Comfort Zone Camp is the nation's largest bereavement camp, and we help children who've experienced a significant loss. Our camps are free of charge, and a really unique, wonderful thing about Comfort Zone is that we also pay for children's travel and a parent or guardian's travel just to remove the barriers to get them to us. It's a lot like a normal camp weekend in that we run games and songs and cheers and things. We act real silly and real goofy, but at the same time, all these kids have had a loss. So there's 60 kids at each camp that are looking around saying, wow, every other kid here has lost someone too. They all get a chance to grieve and they all get a chance to heal with one another. Most first time campers don't want to come to camp. They're afraid all they're going to do is talk about who died or cry all weekend and how much fun is that going to be. They're a little shy, they're nervous, they don't know anybody. Well, within the first hour, we put them through icebreaker games. Instantly, it's upbeat, high energy. You know, it's designed to be that way. Cover Zone is strategically put at a camp because we want the children to have fun. Seeing the ones that come in in the beginning that are a little bit more quiet and reserved, and by the end of the camp, they're really smiling and participating more, and it's good to see that, that progress. In memory of my dad. Memory of my mom and my grandmother. Our tagline is a fun and safe place for grieving children. And I think we do a really good job of putting that forth. This is the first time that I got to be around people um, who have experienced a loss. And that was really important because for a while there, I thought I was the only one. And so coming here was, it was almost like finding a different family. When somebody passes away, it's like your hand straight in front of your face, and you can't see around it. Everything you look at is just that. It's just that death. It's the loss. It's everything associated with it. And over time, all you can really hope is that the hand moves farther and farther away from your face. You know people are going to support you. Nobody's going to laugh at you if you cry. People are going to understand if you choke up, and that's the comfort zone. Each child is signed to their own adult volunteer that we call a big buddy. I had a camper describe to me right after I started with Comfort Zone. Uh, she said that the best big buddy on the planet would be a giant ear with arms and legs so that they could listen and hug. And that's pretty much it. You know, a big buddy is just an ear, is, is someone to listen to these kids. You know, it's the desire to to put a smile on a kid's face. There's this special connection between the bigs and littles. I don't know how they do it. I don't know how they match it, but it's amazing. There's so many nice things to say about my big. I love my big. She is so funny. And how about we just hug? OK. The tempo of the whole weekend allows these kids to blossom and grow and heal, even in that short amount of time. <laughs> Parents who have been worrying all weekend how their child do at camp, and did they cry, did they talk, they come back and see them doing something in tribute of their loved one, and they're just amazed at the transformation that, that a weekend at camp can bring about. <laughs> For me, it's so rewarding to make other kids' grief journeys easier than mine was. I was able to open up. I was able to get like so many like feelings and like things I kept inside like off my chest. We see kids grow right before our eyes, and it, it's amazing. We want kids to come back over and over and over again until they uh, graduate high school. It's the sharing and the support that really makes Camp Comfort Zone just so incredibly valuable and so important. Comfort Zone really is just a good place. No one's here on an agenda. Everyone is here for a common purpose, and, and that's to help grieving kids. We want to help them grow and grieve and learn with us and with the other kids here at camp. Because what better place than where everybody gets you and you're not different? What comfort zone is, is coming into your comfort zone. This is a place that even though you're talking about things that are uncomfortable and you're talking about things that are upsetting and sad, and maybe you don't want to remember, you can because you're in the comfort zone. Most of the children did not have the opportunity to say goodbye to their loved one, and funerals tend to be a little adult-oriented. So this is the opportunity for the children to commemorate their loved ones. 
This is my mom, and she died of asthma, and my grandma wouldn't tell me. I have no idea why, but I don't really know. And then she told me around like school time, and I was really sad. And then sooner or later, last year when I came here, they helped me get over it, and um, it's just really, this place is really helpful to me. Thank <laughs> you.